Hi everyone, this is the walkthrough for the January 22nd gas called Return of the Map by Bill Murphy. Also, happy birthday, Bill. And we have a little killer Sudoku. So normal Sudoku rules apply. One to nine in each row, column, and three by three box. Additionally, we have these clues outside the grid, and they give the sum along the diagonal that's pointed at by the arrow. So the sum of these four cells is 15. Digits can repeat along arrows, so there could be another two on this arrow, say, or another six. And those are the rules. And we'll actually start with that arrow. Uh, we have a 15, but we already have a two and a six on the line, so that's eight. So we need seven in the remaining two cells. To make seven in two cells, there are three ways to do that, but we can't do three, four, and we can't do two, five, so we must do one six instead, and there's a one here to disengage. So we do have two sixes on this blue, and that's totally okay. All right, this 25, we already have 12 from the three and the nine, so we need 13 in these two cells. We can't have four nine, we can't have five eight, so we must have six seven, and that six that we place disambiguates those. This 25 also already has 12 on it from the 4 and 8. So again, we need 13. We can't have 5, 8, 4, 6, 7. So this one has to be 4, 9. And then 9 tells us the order. And here we have 8 again on a 15. So these sum to 7. Can't have 1, 6. We can't have 2, 5. So we have to have 3, 4, and 4 tells us the order. Okay, I'm going to do a little Sudoku next. So we have sixes pointing into this box that are going to place a six. We have fives, ruling five out of those cells, placing five. Seven and eight look up here, so this is a naked nine. Seven and eight finish the box. Right, this cell is also naked. It sees two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So it is a one. This still sees two, three, four, and six, seven, eight, nine in the box. So this is a five. These are two, three, four, but we have fours looking in. And a two, three here. You can see there's some symmetry here with the clues. I think this may be totally symmetric. I didn't even Pay attention to that when I was solving it the first time. Uh, we still need a six in this column. There's a six here. These are also seven and eight. These are two, three, and nine. We have two and nine up here. And then a two, nine here. Finish the box. Here we need two, three, four. We have four in the box, so that's four. These are two and three. And we need one, seven, and eight. So one and eight here. And then one eight here, um, and I didn't even notice when I place that three, it's going to disintegrate two and three, which disintegrates nine and two. The seven does the same thing here. So eight, seven, one and eight, and that eight also gets seven and eight here. The two gets three here. We have one digit left in the row, and that's a six. And at the top, we need a four. And I'm going to go ahead and pencil mark these. Uh, these are 2, 3, 7. These are 2, 5, and 9. That's not 2. These are 1, 5, and 8. That's not 8. These are 3, 7, 8. And now we're going to look at the other little killer. So along this line, along the 16 clue, we already have 4, 2, and 6, which sum to 12. So we need four more. Obviously, if we need four more, the most this can be is one. We can't have five or eight. And then we need three in the other cell. So that one is going to resolve five and eight here. So three from those and that. Down here, we have six plus eight plus four, which is 18. We need 16 more to get to 34. There are multiple ways to do that. 
but we can't have an 8 in this cell, so we can't have 8-8. Eight, eight. Instead, this has to be 9 and 7. That's going to resolve 8-3 and 2-7 and 5-2. And that's all the clues done. We didn't actually have to use these, uh, but we can just check to see that they are correct. So 4 plus 5 is 9, plus 7 is 16, 18, 22. And 11, 14, 22, 28. And now we're just finishing off with classic Sudoku in the middle. So we need 5, 8, and 9 here. Got a 5, 8, 9 pair. We need 1, 2, 5 here. A 1, 2 look down. That means we have four fives looking in the middle. 5 goes in the middle cell. These are 1, 3, and 6. Get a chop teapot. These are four, seven, and nine. Get the same here. So we're gonna have to look for something in the middle. And do I remember where it is? All right, let's just pencil mark this. We need one, three, seven, nine across the middle row. So this is three, nine. 3, 9 here means this is 1, 7. Ah, 1, 2 here means this is 8, 9. This is 2. That gives us errors. Uh, we still need 1, 2, 4, 7. That's what we're missing. 1, 2, 7. Give us a negative 4. 9, 7, 4. The 9 resolves 8, 9, 8. The 7 resolves 1, 2, 1, 2. The 1 resolves 3 and 9, 6 and 1. Now let's fill in the remaining digits. And that is how you solve return of the map.